only light at the end of the tunnel was the wry musings of Andy Rooney at the end of 60 Minutes. Noise is sound you don't want to hear. And of course, one person's sound is another person's noise. So wry. The rest of the day was filled with football, church, and the only school I didn't enjoy attending, Sunday school. And then his mother put baby Moses in a basket and sent him down the river. Why? Maybe he was crying all night and his mother and father needed a break. And maybe his grandmother was in town to help out, but she went to bed early because she had jet lag after her flight from Dallas. She did it because Pharaoh ordered all the male babies to be killed. That's really in the Bible? Yes. And mom will let me read Judy Plume. Sheila the Great changed my life. Back to Moses. He was found by Pharaoh's daughter and went on to lead the Israelites out of Egypt because even when you feel lost, God has a plan for us all. What was his plan for the male babies who didn't get rescued? It's tough to say. There was a decree to throw them in the river. Innocent babies? That is not cool. That was Pharaoh. That was not God. But according to you, it's all part of God's plan. How do you sleep at night? Okay, we're gonna revisit getting me some help with Sunday school. I am ready, willing, and... Nope. I want someone who can really connect with the kids. But connecting with the kids is what I do. What planet are you on? I'm Miss Mary, and I'll be your Sunday school teacher. Oh, no you won't. I will. Slithers, that is a lie. And what's another name for a lie? Uh, sin. Boy, did that suck. Fine. What do you have in mind? It's time we hire a youth pastor. Fresh blood. I like the sound of that. I already put in a call to my buddy at the Southern Baptist Convention. So, this isn't open for discussion? It's already happening? As they say in the rec room Tuesday nights, bingo! Sorry.